What was it like being in something for almost 10 years with Outlander mm. in an industry that does have so much kind of uncertainty and is always yeah. changing? All of my experiences, you know, growing up being a jobbing actor really have influenced and, and I guess shaped me. Um, yeah, but you know, I'm now in this job. I've been on Outlander for almost a decade and uh, I feel very fortunate. It's allowed me to go back to Scotland, back to my homeland and uh, and, it, and rediscover Scotland as well and the, the beauty it has there. Um, and obviously been a, a great journey uh, playing Jamie Fraser as well. Mm. And has it sort of become a family on something, you know, staying together for so long? Yeah, absolutely. You know, I think um, we started eight years ago, myself, my co-stars, especially my co-star Katrina Balfe, who's a you know, magnificent actress um, and a great friend now. You know, she's she's almost like my sister. And we've grown up together. We've had all these amazing experiences. Um, but all the, the cast, you know, and crew as well, you know, we're very, very close. It is like a big family. Um, and it's created relationships that, you know, you never thought you would have you know I have now this this great relationship with Graham McTavish who played my uncle in the show and thankfully I killed him um, <laughs> but he and I have created a, a book series and a tv show as well so yeah a lot has come out of, of Outlander. Yeah and what was it like in the casting process when you first met Katrina um, mm. who, who plays Claire? Yeah it was a um I was very fortunate for me, the casting process was pretty quick and I uh, was cast in this this show that I didn't really know much about um, and I was lucky to be part of the the chemistry reads with other actresses and they were looking for this, the actress to play uh, Claire Beecham um, in the show and they auditioned a lot of a lot of amazing actresses and they still couldn't decide and it was really close to, to us actually starting to shoot. I think two weeks out they found Katrina and I remember her audition. It was um, she was brilliant. She, you know, it was a very physical piece. Uh, it was an argument between Jamie Fraser and Claire, uh, and I remember we actually got very physical with each other. Uh, and at some point, I think I had her in a bear hug, and I could <laughs> see how extremely angry she was with me. But um, but I think that's it. You know, you, you say what is chemistry, and I think that the, the point is the chemistry was that we were just in the moment with each other. You also write that you quite liked fantasy as a teenager. Now oh, you're yeah. obviously in a historical fantasy mm. show. So as a teenager, what sort of things were you attracted to? Yeah, you know, I start the book off. There's a small quote there from Tolkien, and obviously my family um, were big big fans. Uh, my brother was named after an elf from Lord of the Rings. Uh, and not only that, you know, I grew up in the grounds of a castle in Scotland, a derelict castle. So I think that fantasy element, you know, I imagined myself as Robert the Bruce or, uh, you know, King Arthur, what are the, all these things. These were great influences to me growing up, but I still still am desperate to, to be an elf or a dwarf. So if the, the Rings of Power are still casting, I'm, I'm available. I've even got a ginger wig if, if they're <laughs> interested. I can imagine you as an elf. Thank you. Well, I may have uh, I may have had some prosthetics done at some point. You might see in future. Oh, yeah, yeah. well, that's very exciting. Yeah, it's a lot of fun. Yeah. <laughs>